everybody, this is Mirav, and today I'm going to teach you how to use the Customers Manager of iGemla Digistore. So you go to Customers here on the left under Managers, and here you can see a list of all your customers. And if you want to add a new customer, click on New on top, and now you have two options. You can either add a customer who doesn't already e exist in a database, or you can add the customer that already exists in a database. That means when you go to Site User Manager, you should be able to see uh, the customer there if they are already in the database. So if you're adding somebody who's not in the database, click Next, and then you'll have to fill out all their information. Okay, just like they would do on the front end. The reason we need all this information is that we need to know, for example, their billing address so that we'll know what kind of tax to charge them if we, if, uh, we do charge uh, them taxes. So it's important to fill it all out. Now, if you choose to add somebody who is already in the database, then you'll have to fill out less details because some of the details you're already going to have. So let's say uh, Rav, and then I'm going to click Next. You enter their username here. Oh, it says this user already exists as a customer. Please choose another. Okay, so I'm going to try another user. And let's see what happened. I need to click on Next. Okay, and this is what I get. I get a form that is partially filled out with the username. Uh, sometimes if I have it, it's going to show the first name, last name, and email address. And then you have to fill out the rest. And when you're done, click Save and it's going to add the customer this way. One more thing about Customer Manager, and you can search by customer name, uh, first name, last name, email, whatever other information you have, and you'll find the customers. So this is it about Customers Manager of iJumla uh, Digistore. Thanks for watching.